is this no surprise? Because our destinies run together, Raziel, like two rivers that have met and can never be distinct again. At your every fatal turn, you'll find me. And the free will you said was mine. What has become of that? You still have it. And that has everything to do with my presence here now. It was your machinations that set my destiny in motion. The coin you tossed has struck the earth. Now you must abide by its outcome. The coin is still turning, Raziel. To reach the resolution we both can live with, that will best serve our futures, Janos Ordren must not be raised. Because you do not wish it. Is my free will to be exercised only when it accords with your will? There is much more at stake in this than you know. Yes, and it is Janos who has the answers I desire. You must trust me, Raziel. Our intentions for Mosgoth, for our futures, are not so diverse. I must trust you. Or... I've not come here to threaten you, Raziel. You say that? while you hold in your hand the instrument of my doom. I saved you from the Reaver once. I have no intention of imprisoning you within the blade. At least not until the moment it serves your plans to do so. You are not the only one at risk. I may carry the instrument of your destruction, but I too have taken a chance in coming here. Or haven't you realized? You bear the only weapon that can kill me. <laughs> then you know what I am. And who you are. I believe I do. And still you think you can move me about like your pawn? Think again, King. Take heed, Raziel. What? If we are who we are, then are we not destined to fight to the death to decide the fate of Nosgoth? Don't be a fool. I will not fight you. And that will be the prophesied hero's battle. I win because you will not fight me. <laughs> The mighty king, scion of balance, would-be savior of Nosgoth, surrenders before the final battle even begins. Very well. If this will make you see reason...
darkness of this place had somehow fueled my rage. And as it subsided, I felt no elation, no sense of victory. Only a calm certainty that we had once again walked blindly into our enemy's trap. I couldn't be sure whether Cain had truly intended to destroy me. And now it appeared I would never know.